Hello, I'm Super Lucky Die, and I'm going to show you how to copy and paste things on the internet, Facebook, and Twitter. Now, copying and pasting can be really useful for compers because you might want to save the terms and conditions for a competition, or you might want to copy the link to a competition and share it on a forum or a Facebook group. So, I'm going to copy the terms and conditions for this competition. So, click and hold the mouse button down, and then drag down the page all the way to the bottom. That's highlighted all the text, and then on a Mac, Command and C to copy, or Control and C if you're on a PC. As well as using keyboard shortcuts, you can also right click on your mouse to copy things. So if I right click there, there's copy in my menu. In my notes app, I just right click again and paste. If you use Chrome, you can also go into your Chrome menu at the top here and find cut, copy and paste under the edit menu. If you want to copy the link to a website, simply click once in the address bar. You might have to actually click twice or three times depending on the settings you've got and the browser you use. Once you've got it highlighted, just use your shortcut on the keyboard, Command C or Control C to copy it. Now if you need to get a link to a post on a Facebook page, that's a bit trickier. To open up an individual post from a newsfeed or a timeline in its own window, click on the timestamp underneath. That opens it up in a new window and you can then click the top bar and copy the web address from there. A quick way of doing that without actually opening it in its own window is to right click on that timestamp and choose copy link address from there. If you see a post on your newsfeed from a friend and you want to find the original post, if you look at the text at the top here, you can see that that photo link, that's what's going to take you to the original competition post on the Zatchels page. So you can open the link, check that it's the right post, and then copy that link from the address bar at the top. If you want to copy the link to a tweet, again, you've got to look for the timestamp in your feed. Click on that to open it in a new window, and you can copy the address from the bar at the top. A quicker way to do it on your feed is either to right-click the timestamp and copy link address, or underneath the tweet, click the three dots and copy link to tweet. Here's how to copy and paste on your mobile device. First of all, press and hold your finger on the text you want to copy. It will be highlighted blue and you'll see two blue markers, one each end. You can move those markers around to select the text that you want. You can even drag them all the way down the page and carefully continue until you've got all the text that you want to copy. Next, tap copy. I'm going to paste this text into a new note using my Evernote app on my phone. To do that, tap on the screen and release. You'll see the word paste. Tap on that to paste your text. To copy a website address on your mobile device, open up the address in your web browser, tap on the top banner, choose select all and then copy the web address. You can also find the link by going into the options menu top right of Chrome and looking for the share icon at the top. Tap on that and then choose copy from the bottom. To copy the link to a Facebook post in the app, look for the share button underneath the post. Tap on that and then choose copy link. To copy a link from the Twitter app, simply tap and hold on a tweet and choose copy link to tweet. Alternatively, tap on the tweet and then look for the three dot menu underneath and choose copy link to tweet from there. If you enjoyed this guide, don't forget to subscribe to my channel.